Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about what I do when our check comes and it is short. Okay, so this paycheck, my husband did forget to submit his overtime, so his check is short. Um, so what I usually do when that happens is I will take what I need from our savings and use that to what his paycheck would have been. And then when he gets it and we're overpaid on the next check, I just pay it right back to savings. So that is a good reason to have kind of a buffer in your savings account or just an emergency fund. You can take it temporarily out of your emergency fund if you need to, because it is ultimately money that you are paying back when that money comes back to you. So um, I just took what I needed from savings and am using that to make our paycheck. 2650 would be the paycheck. Um, and then, you know, I do my, my temporary budget just based off of 2300 um, and I went through and did that in green, so that's there. And then our budget, now that we're doing together, we'll be using $26.50. So, let me go through. Um, not much has changed. $222. I don't believe much has changed here. Um, we're not paying anything to student loans. Peloton hasn't changed. Um, I do believe that that increased. Uh, let me go. 90 minus 35. So I think I have to put in 55 here. 50, 81, 86, 40, 100. Six, eight, and consumers did go up. I do believe I have to put in. Let me look. Okay, so in consumers, I do have to put 89. All right, so let's add all that up and see what we're at. Okay, that leaves us with 1184. Okay, so now our cash envelopes 300, 100, 25, 10, 10, 50, 10. Still zero. Still have quite a bit of money in that envelope, so. with 679 Christmas car maintenance Andrew vacation I'm gonna leave blank until I know what we're working with 42 30 11 20 20 Let's do 30 here. And then for my savings challenges, so savings challenge one is going to be this whole row because um, the way that it works is I would do five per week and each paycheck for my husband is about two weeks. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. 20, 26, yeah, okay. So five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 15, 20, yep, 26, okay. So savings challenge one is gonna be 26. 
and this is our savings challenge two, which is every week. This is the one I made. Um, every week you roll two dice and the total on the dice determines how much you save that week. So remember each paycheck is for two weeks. So I'm going to roll the dice twice. So the first one, five, that's 15. Snake eyes is two. So that's 17. Let's roll it one more time. Nine is 35. So 17 and 35, 52. All right. So we're going to do 52. And then our third savings challenge is, um, this is the one that I made as well. And this is a 12 month weather savings challenge. Whatever the temperature is on the first day of that month is how much you save for that month. So the average temperature for March 1st was 46 degrees. So I'm just gonna write it here so that I don't forget. Um, but you can see over here, I did not finish filling out for February because I still have to do my second paycheck cash envelope stuffing. I'm going to the bank today and I'm pulling out for February's last paycheck and for March's first paycheck. And I'm going to do a double cash envelope stuffing in the next video. So check that one out. Um, but so it's going to be 46 and typically I just divide that number in half and then I do half for each paycheck. So for this paycheck, it's going to be $23 going in. So let's put that down. So let's add all these numbers up right now and see where we're at and what we're going to have left to work with. So we still have 255 to work with. So I am going to do the fives for my kids. So 255 minus 15. Um, we're gonna do 100 into emergency. We're gonna do 20 towards the stove and then we'll do 120 into vacation. So that's how we're going to do that one. Now let's add everything up again to make sure. All right, so that's 544 here. would leave us with 135 and then 100 plus 15 plus 20 is 135 and that leaves us with zero so that right now is our zero based budget so I'm gonna flip this over and I will be right back I'm gonna fill in our categories for our cash envelope breakdown so I know exactly what to get from the bank I'll be right back all right I'm back here's our categories I can remember most of them, but I may do some flipping. Okay, so groceries, spending, medical, toiletries, miscellaneous, entertainment, Christmas, clothing, car maintenance was 30, right? Yep. Okay. Vacation, what did we say? 120. Birthday, 42. 30 for miscellaneous holiday, homeschool, 20, home. All right, so we have 26, 52, 52, 23, emergency, five, 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 and then 20 going into stove. Okay, all right, let's amp it up and see what we're at. So that would be 1038. Let me add back in what I took out to make sure that that balance is right. So I add in subscriptions because that's not 
in there and then I add in Andrew and then I add in our bill 1466 uh, we're short a hundred somewhere <laughs> what am I doing let me try one more time okay so it's 1038 plus 35 plus 11 plus 100 plus 1466 2650 there we go okay so everything balances so let's go through and mark down the bills that I want um, I usually just try and keep the bills as high as I possibly can just to simplify things for myself 25 10 10 50 10 105 30 30 1 20 40 2 20 30 20 20 25 26 50 2 23 100 5 10 15 and 20 all right let's go through and add those up 3 4 5 6 6 is 600 2 is 100 1 2 3 4 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 is 240 wow Sorry, I needed a calculator for that. Three, six is 60. Three, six is 30. Two, three, six, seven, eight. All right, let's add this up and see what we're at. It should be 1038. Six plus one plus 240 plus 60 plus 30 plus eight. 1038. All right, so that's what we're getting out of bank for this check. And then I'm gonna get out of the bank for my last check because I haven't done that yet. And then I will do a double cash envelope stuffing and we will update all of my savings challenges and my debt payoff charts. So stick around for that. If you guys have any questions about how I did this, um, please leave them down below. And I have addressed the comments, but I'm gonna say it here too. I am working on getting these up as printables for you guys. It will be up very, very soon. I just have to um, get it all transferred over. So thank you guys so much for checking out my video. Again, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. I love talking to you guys in the comments. Thank you so, so much for watching my video and supporting my channel. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye.